Have you ever let an intrusive thought win? A couple months ago while I was streaming, I had the wonderful idea of what if I could play the Nintendo Switch, the sports game they had out, without using my hands. And well, it went decent. So I just kind of wanted to go back over the stream I did of it and just kind of highlight my journey to greatness with using a certain appendage. So here, I'm just kind of demonstrating what I could do with not my hands. <laughs> I would say I'm embarrassed, but honestly, at this point, you should not expect better from me. So my initial idea here was I would have one to block and the other to strike. But after a little while, that kind of felt like cheating almost because technically speaking, I was using a hand. But we would figure out how to do much better as we went along. But here, Alyssa was about to suffer my wrath. Kinky. No. No. Come on. Get it. And poor Catherine stood no chance oh, got the most into the there. drink. Already. Fight. But Barbara was a lot more of a test than I was anticipating. Just because the guard, because she was in, up, oh, will count her. And she just would not let up. I can't guard. As you can see, the angle of the dangle was prompt for striking. But unfortunately, we'll get that counter back off on me every time. But with sheer effort, perseverance, and luck, we got her on the first round. But she came back swinging, and I went in the drink on the second. So after this, I figured oh, yes. no, we yes, have sir. sword fighting somewhat figured out, Bitch. but can we play tennis? Huh? I chest pains over this shit. Ooh. Here's my other Joy-Con. No hands. We yeah, had we fully it. committed to the no hands philosophy. Andrews will say he's fake. Play. Serving was a bit difficult to figure out because getting that nice little Pop on it proved to be a little bit of an intriguing motion, if you will. At this point, if you'll notice, I was kind of feeling myself in the weirdest of ways. I regret nothing. So now that we had tennis figured out, I need a more skill-based game. Oh, so, why not golf? Obviously, we can right. deliver the power. But what about accuracy? Right here. Here we go. I thought it was going to be the greatest no, shot in no, human no, history. No, Unfortunately, no, 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 no. I'm an idiot. That's fine. We had a bit of a curve to the dangle. It, it kind of went off to one side. But we made it to the green. No, we were, have a clear we were path to victory is the most important part. We're close though. Yeah. Right here, all we have to do is little Next baby step. steps, incremental. Get it. Just step by step, we we're going to make right. it in. Sometimes a journey is a bunch of little steps. Then. Now that we have a skill base, what about technique? Precision. We got there, okay? Shut up. <laughs> At this point, we were locked in. We could only get better from here. This was the moment that I had achieved greatness. Finally, after what was hours of 
making multiple attempts a strike. And now, I figured the most rigorous sport that requires the most demanding training, badminton. And I brought the fury. There were many intensive exchanges in this field of battle. <laughs> Josh returned. Josh returned back. Harry, counter. I believe the normal badminton game ends at like four. And this one would drag out two times over to, I believe, six. Which I don't know what the average badminton game kind of goes over, you know, match point. But I like to think we were having an epic clash of fates, if you will. But also, I'm the guy that was playing badminton with his junk. So who can trust me, really? If anyone wants to challenge me to a sword fight, just know that I've been training and I'm ready. 